Who says games are easy? Every now and again, a game comes along that makes you hurl your controller across the room. This is a list of the top 5 hardest games ever made. 5. Back when Mike Tyson was one of the greatest, most feared boxers in the world, a game was made featuring the man himself. Most of the game is fondly remembered, from the confidence building glass Joe to the soft drink addicted soda Popinski. It was fun, pattern based boxing that required quick reactions and memorization. Until you get to Tyson. This is where the fun ride was over. One punch from him knocks you to the mat, and your punches do almost nothing. The ramp in difficulty is perilous and incredibly frustrating. Out of nowhere, you're getting your ass kicked, and there is nothing you can do about it. Bear in mind, once you lose against Tyson, there's no continue and there's no save. You go back to the beginning and do it all again. So all you gotta do is keep trying it again and again and again. Incredibly frustrating and incredibly difficult. 4. This game brought back old school difficulty this past generation. Demon Souls has the uncanny ability to make you think you are somehow in control. And it's precisely at these times where you immediately die. This can be from a single enemy encounter or even a measly fall. The hardest part to swallow is starting back at the very beginning of each stage every single time. This is not something typically found in titles nowadays. There are no checkpoints, no autosaves, you battle your way to the final boss at the end of each stage, of course once you get there you realise how immensely powerful he is and you die. Now comes the privilege of playing the entire stage again. Needless to say, a couple of my controllers have been lost to this game. 3. Taking on the role of military commanders Bill Mad Dog Riser and Lance Scorpion Bean, you need to destroy an organisation known as Red Falcon and stop them from taking over the world. You were armed with rifles that had infinite ammo, so it doesn't sound so difficult, right? Until you realise that a single hit from an enemy means instant death. One hit, dead. And to top it off, you only had three lives to see you through the whole mission. Thankfully, Contra was one of the earliest games to feature the now legendary Konami code, which granted you 30 lives when input correctly, and at the very least gave you a fighting chance. Without the code, however, seeing the end is almost impossible. 2. Released as a free download, I Wanna Be The Guy is an indie platformer that mashes up characters, music and sounds from lots of other 8-bit and 16-bit games. Sounds fun, right? Wrong. Making progress is infamously difficult, as each screen is designed to kill you in as many ways as possible. As well as obvious hazards like enemies and spikes, levels are littered with hidden traps and objects that behave unexpectedly which could only be identified by prior knowledge or trial and error. Meaning, you had no idea what was safe until you figure out all the various ways the level is going to kill you. The game over screen was burned into your retinas long before the end was in sight. 1. Taking on the role of Knight Sir Arthur, you fight off all manner of zombies, demons and dragons while attempting to rescue Princess Prin Prin, who had been kidnapped by Satan himself. Progress was tough, as a mere two hits would reduce you to your underwear, then kill you. And each level had a strict time limit that led to instant death if it expired. Worse still, after defeating the final boss, a screen of text announced that this battle was just an illusion and a trap devised by Satan, sending you right back to the start to play through the entire game on a harder difficulty level before achieving the true ending which contains a screen of uh, misspelled text and horrible, horrible grammar. This game was not only difficult, it was the original middle finger to gamers. There you go folks, the top 5 hardest games ever. Thanks for watching.